Hey guys, customers looking to replace furnace and AC. Set up here. New media, new humidifier. Uh, not a whole lot of room here, so the humidifier is actually installed kind of funky due to space. So actually what we'll need to do is make a uh, piece to come off that return ductwork and mount the humidifier a little bit differently. Uh, line set's actually going to have to be new, so on the outside, which I'll show you, they got the suction line dry right up against the house, so you can't cut it off, and then it's actually leaking water in the ceiling. And I'll show you here on the other side. And the gas line's here. Go back with an 80% furnace. We're in a condo association, so they don't think they can bring PVC venting out. Uh, but we're limited on space here, so between the water heater and the wall, we only have 16 inches, but the furnace is 17 and a half wide. So we can either take the water heater out, or if you want, you guys, we can lift it up and go over the top of it. So send an extra guy out here, and then come up and lift it over, and then set it down on the other side. But we're going to be doing new return drop, new flue T, so everything will be out of the way. Four drain is zero. Uh, we are on a 40 amp breaker, which is marked. Make sure that's correct. And then above that ceiling, right there. So if you go above there, there's your combustion grill. For there, we're actually going to have to go above the ceiling over there. So there's your one access hole, but it actually leaks water because it has no insulation. And that's an access door to the back side of everything. So you'll be able to take off if need to. Um, but we're going to run our lines through there. And I told them we have to cut an opening in that soffit. And we'll attempt to kind of just go straight out on the outside. Currently they go down the wall about three or four feet to the bottom side of that window, but over here. Um, but we're going to attempt to go straight out, and she's aware of that. And if we need to go down, then we'll have to cut a hole, but we'll put a couple more access points, like this one that's right here, ones that you can pop off, but one down there, maybe one down here if needed. Uh, no walkout, so you'll have to go up the steps right there. So Here's the outdoor unit here. Uh, it's currently got a fuse disconnect, and it's in the siding there, so we're just going to keep it. Um, if you want, you can try running a new seal tight up to the box. If not, you can do just like they did and tie on to conduit that's already out. Uh, there's the suction line dryer, so as you can see, they didn't leave you a whole lot of room. And as you can see, we're kind of at the window, bottom of the window height there. Uh, and we're actually going to be coming out somewhere, same height, that black wire. I mean, customer is aware and knows that we're going to have to run down. Uh, AC, though, is currently in front of the electric meter, so we're actually going to take and scoot it over this way. So they have room to work on it. It's got a deck or a fence being put up, which may or may not be up by the time we're here, but this in between here is going to be a, an opening for the gate. And then we're going to have to walk around the side of the house with the AC unit. You can park out there in the front. And then just come around the side over here and be able to get into this unit here. Good luck. <laughs> 